So one of my little homegirls, she got a six-year-old son and he real smart. The other day, they was in the car and he said, mommy, mommy, why doesn't my friend go to my school anymore? Like a good parent, she told him, well, his mother and father thought it would be a better idea for him to go to public school. Six-year-old loans, mommy, why would his parents send him to public school? They don't believe in God. What? Like a good parent who don't want to get embarrassed when they see that parent when their kids get around because you know kids just burn out everything, she said, honey, that doesn't mean that school doesn't believe in God. You know what this little six-year-old said? Well, mommy, do they pray? No. Well, mommy, do they have chapel? No. Mommy, can they say grace at lunch? No. Okay, mommy, can they mention Jesus? No. I'm gonna keep it 100 with you. What came out this little boy mouth next is profound. He said, well, mommy, if you can't do any of those things, then you don't love God. Dang. Being the great mother she is, she explained to him that the school may not allow people to do that, but that doesn't mean that Christian people and people who love God don't go to the school. But when you think about it, little dude had a profound point. Many times we look at all the things that are going wrong in schools and we say, man, these school systems need to get together. And you right. But the truth is, if we don't look at God's standards and try to do it God's way, it's always going to be an issue. I mean, think about what your life was like before you gave your life to God. I mean, and if you yet still seeking the truth of Jesus Christ, just think about what your life is like now. <laughs> Flat out. You done wasted so many years being disappointed on what you thought was right. I think it's time now for you to do right. Flat out. So this school year, I'm praying for every teacher, every student, all the faculty at every school. But what I'm asking you to do, and what I want you to understand, that if they're taking God out, it's important that children get a chance to see your godly presence by your actions every single day. I can't afford for you to start acting crazy and acting the fool because these kids in public school need you to be the Christian at the spot. So I'm sending this out to everybody right now, and I want you to pray this school year that our teachers, our faculty, and everybody is covered, and they act like they Christian. Remember, you may discover things that are lost, but sometimes you can't get back a lost opportunity. The world needs you, and this is your opportunity. Flat out. Hey family, make sure that you share this with as many people as possible. Just click share if it's on Facebook. You copy the link and start texting people and make sure that this thing do a million hits. Share, share, share with as many people as possible. Make sure that you subscribe to this YouTube channel if you're watching on YouTube. I'll see you next week. Flat out. Well, the kingdom is my business, but not this right.